hey hi everyone so this is Daniel today is something different it's a Photoshop tutorial so I'm gonna teach you and how to replicate uh, this uh, animated uh, gif or gif so to your success Daniel so your picture will be there and you will learn and this is, we can create this from Photoshop so uh, let's get into it and see you there okay great so now we're gonna do uh, create a new file by clicking new and the size of my project is 640 and by 280 for the height 72 the resolution 8 bits RGB color and I put it on a transparent background so click OK and what you have to do after is just to uh, create a new layer and go back to the layer one and make it white so we're gonna put the background as white so and here we're gonna just put background because at any time we're gonna start to create uh, you can make it transparent at any time if you want to match let's say the color of your website we can change the color so that's why I put it transparent first so now we will need uh, we will need uh, a picture of yourself so what you do you take a picture and you just uh, with the electrical tools here you make the round of your face you cut it and you give maybe an inner shadow so like this this picture will go on your new project uh, this one oops maybe the next one yeah so and you're gonna uh, make it smaller by control T and that's perfect so we have the first uh, object you know we need to have in our project now what is missing is the the brush so you can type uh, in Google brush tool PNG select something is very uh, realistic you know and when you find something uh, who please you what you do you make sure you remove the the background you know the the white around it and also when after I do that I always put the effect of stroke and I do erase all the bad part you know like this so I always make sure everything is neat and when you're satisfied you drag this picture you know into your project so like this here and then just remove my um, my stroke and what you do after you just make sure okay let me just fix this thing white there okay so make sure you click on control T and resize your brush and probably give the angle you wish for this one is a little too big still so always uh, shift your picture you know and just make it that this is perfect like that so then I apply perfect so now we have two elements and then you have to create your text so open a new a new layer take your text make your color black I'm using Lucida handwriting italic 40 points smooth and then I will put here uh, best regard you know and with a comma and on another layer just put your your name you know my name is Danielle so we have the four elements for our project you know so we make sure we gonna put it at the right angle so like this should be pretty good so yeah this this one should be pretty good so now we have the four element four elements sorry and we're ready to uh, make the animation not now because we need to prepare those texts uh, with the animation first so I will see you to my next segment so see you there okay so uh, now at this moment we're gonna move you know we're gonna create the text ready for the animation so I will just uh, close my brush so I will close my brush and even the best regard also I'm gonna just use Daniel so what you will do uh, on your name you will click on the white box where's the text control so click on the control button and click on the text at the same time you see here I'm gonna zoom on this you see the the, the text is like uh, doing some funny stuff there so that's pretty okay 
and over your name open a new uh, a new layer and D just remove the eyeballs there just close on your on your name there just close it so you see your you still see your name Danielle but with no fonts no color inside of it so this is how we're gonna start to create the, the effect of your name so usually I'm taking a brush I'm using the hardness you know hundred percent and 26 is too big so I will go around maybe 10 10 pixel it's still just little too big maybe around 8 will be good yeah 8 is pretty yeah that's very good so now what I will do I will start from the top and I will just make a little like this you know don't make because you need to make maybe letters 3 to 5 uh, stroke you know to f to fill up your first letter so this one is my first one what I will do you see layer 5 I will create another layer over it and then I will continue you know like this to maybe stop here then I will create another layer and I will stop maybe around here and then I will create another layer and I will finish the letter so that will be one letter done so what I do I click another layer and I will start with the A to, from the bottom so I will just do little like this I will open another create another layer just go to the top like this I will open another layer and go to the bottom so that's three and op uh, create a new layer and finish my A so that this is my second letter so then I create another layer and I will do my N maybe up to here it takes patience guys you know so then I will do up to here for my second action on the end so create a new layer and then I will stop maybe to this part and create a new layer and I will finish my end so so far three later is done so then I will create a new layer and I will do my eye and a new layer and I will do maybe up to here so create a new layer and I will just do almost to finish there and I will finish my letter here so you see so so far four letter is done create a new layer I will do my E create a new layer then I will just you know up to here and then a new layer so this one will take five action and then create a new layer and I stroke up to here and then a new layer and I will finish my letter and lastly my last one the L this one will be done in three actions so one a new layer two and then three so then what you can do deselect so control D for deselect so now my name has been written but as you see it took me uh, from layer 5 to layer 28 so that's about 23 uh, layers what I do uh, control shift and then I, I press control G to regroup them together it's not necessary but it's for the organization and here I will rename it Daniel text so like this I know where's my file for it so this is uh, perfect for that so now I'm not gonna create the best regard uh, now you know uh, how what to do with those letters if you want to animate it them so what we'll do on the next segment I will show you how to uh, finish your project okay so now it's time to for the picture you know uh, to make it the you know the kind of uh, the brush over it to make it appear uh, bit by bit so when you over uh, your picture make sure you're gonna we're gonna put a mask so the mask is this button here at the bottom you will click on it and then here it's white what we want we want to put it black so you're gonna reverse the color you know and then take your your paint bucket tool and over your picture uh, click one time put the black there oh the picture is gone but here on my on my uh, you know this uh, the selecting layer mask it's black now what we have to do we have to put the white here choose the white 
take a brush but now we're gonna take a soft brush so like this one and we're gonna take uh, let's say a size of maybe maybe 15 will be good yeah that will be good and then make sure we click inside the black here and we're gonna reveal the picture so if I go like this so that's the first uh, the first part of my picture I reveal then this I will do uh, I will duplicate this layer by control G and then again I will click inside the black and then I will reveal the second part of my picture so this is so far my second part control G again and then click inside the, the black here and then come back with more reveal of your picture so you can make sure everything is nice control G again click inside the black mask there and come back so you can make that maybe four to eight times uh, depending how big is your picture control G and click inside the black mask and then come back reveal more of your picture so this is the action you want so control G and click inside the black and come back from from the other side and then control G again click inside the black and come back on the other side so we almost done here and control G click inside the black mask and we're almost done and the next one uh, again control G click inside the black mask and we will reveal everything from here so you see so then you you make sure your everything is well done you see so what you can do is go back to where it is up to layer 3 shift everything together and create a new doc, a, a new group document so control G and I will call it a Daniel picture so everything is there so now we're ready to uh, create the animation the way we want it we have nothing else to do so I will see you to the next segment